what's going on youtube fam welcome back to another video so today is father's day so shout out to all the fathers out there happy father's day i am a father myself of four kids now as you can see my little newborn right there just chilling hey daddy and my other three are somewhere around here so well not get into that <laughs> but today let's get into uh more details on my turtles and feeding so let's get to it Alrighty, so here we go as i mentioned for those who haven't seen my previous two videos that is one of my turtles rex he is a musk turtle and the other two are around here somewhere gonna be in the log Oh, there is my yellow belly. His name is Yoda. And, oh, there he is, big boy. That is Crush, my common, common snapping turtle. And uh, for those who haven't seen my last video, uh, as I mentioned, this filter does make a lot of noise when it hits the water. And my wife kind of <laughs> got mad about that. She said it makes too much noise, so... I try not to have it on too much, but I try to have it on uh, a bit here and there. That way this nasty water can circulate uh, into the filter and the filter can clean out the water. So let's get into this video. So let's see how we do this. So, oh, come here, little guy. This is Rex. He is my musk turtle. Cool little show there. Cool little patterns on the bottom as well. Pretty big eyes, man. So, so I got him at the flea market. <laughs> Typical, huh? Uh, and he is a pretty cool turtle to have. So I like him very much. Now, let's get into my common snapping turtle, Crush, pretty good, cool turtle. I got him actually when he was a hatchling from someone off Craigslist. Look at him, he's going wild. He always does that whenever I carry him. But he is a cool turtle and he is getting bigger, so I'm trying to figure out what kind of habitat i'm gonna build for him when he gets a little older uh, as i mentioned i do live in an apartment so there's not much i can do right now due to spacing but we'll figure out what to do with this guy sooner or later all right all right now you're getting a little excited there now my yellow belly is going to be the problem since he always likes to hang out on the bottom like you never get them out, but let's try. Well, last resort is I'm going to have to lift up this up. Put that right there in a little bit. Look at him, trying to go under the filter now. Come here. <laughs> I got you. So, this is Yoda. He is my yellow belly. It's pretty small. Also, got him at the flea market <laughs> typical so rex and yoda i did get at the flea market together uh, i bought yoda first and then i went back to get rex and i seen him and i liked his pattern pretty much liked him so ended up getting him so yeah these are my turtles uh, i have three and uh, they're pretty cool um they do get along very well and um as you can hear in the background my newborn is crying so let's attend to him real quick all righty guys now that we got all that settled it's time to feed the turtles so as i mentioned on my previous videos for those who haven't seen it this is what i do feed my turtles for now uh that they're small 
you know, uh, just, you know, regular floating sticks uh, that I got at Walmart. So, let's get this open here. And start the feeding. Come on. So, Crush is usually the one I feed first because he does kind of bully the other two for the food. So, all right, dude, stop it there. I use this kind of to lure him in to come get the food. There he goes. It's crazy how you recognize his knife. Plastic knife, he knows it's feeding time. So, come on. Come on. There he goes. Bam, awesome. <laughs> so, now let's try to get the other two. Oh, there's uh Come on, Rex. There's Rex right there, as you can see. Come on, dude. <laughs> Here comes Yoda. Yep, they know it's feeding time, so. There you go. Ooh, <laughs> kind of fighting for the food. Hey, guys, it's enough for everybody. Come on. Fighting. <laughs> They're fighting. Look at him. Calm down, guys. Come on, Yoda. Get it. Boom. There we go. So, since Crush is the biggest one out of both, he does tend to swallow one stick whole. And try to bite my finger. Over here, dude. This guy is pretty kind of smart. He just usually follows my finger. And I lead him to the food. Oh, well, I just feel like being smart today. So I'm gonna have to use the knife trick. There we go. Seize it. Well, missed, dude. And bam, right on the money. <laughs> so this is kind of my daily routine in the morning and at night, whenever I do come back from work. Uh, just a typical feeding. I do feed them twice a day, you know, a couple of sticks uh, per turtle in the morning and then a couple of sticks per night. And as far as that goes, I mean, that's pretty much it. Um, there's the other two hiding back there. What's that? It's probably like Rex. And sorry for these little nasty glimpse on the tank. Um, I do need to clean this tank. As I mentioned, I do clean the tank uh, once a week or, uh, you know, every other week. And uh, times that I don't clean the tank, I use this solution right here. Turtle tank sludge remover. It's actually pretty good. That's what it does. And uh, I usually drop about two teaspoons in here of this solution and it does the job. Whenever the water's musky and dirty, I drop about two teaspoons in there and let it, you know, flow through the the filter there and the cycle and it cleans everything it cleans the water makes it a little more clear go rex and um yeah i will do a video of a tank cleaning and how i clean them and keep them clean as well whenever i do clean the tank this guy over here is done too again there you go oh seize it boom right on the money get a rex boom awesome and um yeah i'll let you guys see the process on how i clean the tank and and the stuff that i do uh as i mentioned in my previous videos for those who haven't seen it this here is just you know a basic uh starter kit tank that i got whenever i first got these turtles um i like the little natural rainforest look that it has uh, might do something different to it. Uh, I'm not sure yet. 
for those who want to see a video about that just you know comment in the section down below and i want to hear your ideas and for this idea i usually i originally had thought of just uh you know getting rocks and putting rocks all around here and making this look like a natural waterfall or the filter that way it doesn't make much noise when it comes back and hits the, the water because like i said my wife really doesn't like all that water noise when it's hidden back so she did say something about that so we gotta come up with a plan to uh you know fix that situation bam there we go that's yoda eden so uh that was my you know general idea but if y'all guys have uh different ideas on you know what i should do in this area uh as i mentioned again comment down in the section below and uh let me know what y'all guys think but yep this is my daily routine for feeding and um a little more insight on my turtles personally uh because the other you know Two videos were a little short so i'm trying to extend the videos for you guys that way you know y'all have something to see and keep yourselves occupied and uh, as i mentioned today is father's day so i don't know what we have planned today so uh i will wrap up today's video with this and uh hopefully y'all guys enjoy again like like subscribe and comment and uh let me know what kind of videos i would like to see more of and uh we'll get it done so again happy father's day shout out to all my fathers out there hope y'all have a good day and uh we'll see you on the next one peace